Hello everyone, welcome back to Mathmo. Today we have an interesting algebra problem. We need to simplify this. We have square root of 5.25 minus square root of 5. How can we simplify this? First of all, let's write this 5.25 as 5 plus 0 0.25. So let's write this as 5 plus 0 0.25 and plus and minus square root of 5 minus square root of 5. So we just write this 5.25 as a sum 5 plus 0 0.25. What are we going to do next? Take a look. We, if we write a formula a minus b to the second power square, it will be equal to a square plus b square and minus 2ab. So this is our formula. And take a look. We can rewrite this expression in another way. So if we can write this square root as this 5 as square root of 5, so let's do this. We can write this one as square root of, write this as square root of 5 square. And this will be the same 5 if we raise this square root to the second power, it will be the same. So let's write this 0 0.25 as plus 0 0.5 square. This will be the same 0 0.25, but we write it in another way. And let's write this square root of 5. So near this square root of 5, let's write a product. So let's write minus 2 times 1 half and times square root of square root of 5. So if we multiply this, we will have 1. And if we have the same as right here. So this, this expression is the same in this square root. So this is the same and this is the same. Right here we will have 1, 1 times square root of 5 will be square root of 5. If we raise these elements to the second power, we will have this, this sum. So, but what I want to show you, take a look, this a, this will be our a, and this will be our b. Moreover, this will be our b square, and this will be our a square. And right here we have 2, 1 half, this is our b, and square root of 5, this is our a. So, if we look closely to this, this explanation, we will have that this will be equal to the same as our formula. So this is our, our formula, a minus b square. So let's write this as square root of, of a square root of 5 minus 0 0.5 square this will be our formula. And moreover, we need to know one thing, that if we have square root of a square, this will be equal to, square root of a square will be equal to absolute value of a. So, if we take square root from the second power, from here, we will have that this will be equal to absolute value of a. So, as a result, we will have that this will be equal to absolute value of square root of 5 minus 0 0.5. And we know that square root of 5 is greater than, if square root of 5 is greater than 0 0.5, so we can write without the absolute value, so the answer will be square root of 5 minus 0 0.5. And this will be our answer. So firstly, we created a formula, a minus b square, we write this expression used in this way, and this will be our formula, a minus b square. We put this formula instead of this expression, and we know that square root of a square equal to absolute value of a, and we write that this will be equal to absolute value of a minus b, and as a result we will have our answer square root of 5 minus 0 0.5. If you still have any question, write a question in the comment. Thank you for watching and see you in the next videos.